Good morning, everybody. Today we're going to make a blanket ladder. So the first thing I've done, I've already done this, is cut the steps into 16-inch pieces. And then you have two 6-foot uprights. And you're going to measure and mark. First mark that 12 inches. And then 16 after that, so 28, 44, and 60. And then you're going to do the same thing to the other side. And then I usually put a, a notch at the bottom so I know which ones are the bottom, where, which end are the bottom pieces. And then we're going to take our cross steps. And what you're going to do is take your drill. And I use number six screws by inch of five eighths, which I you know, you can use a little bit longer if you want. I tend to use these because they're not too, too long. And what you're going to do is you're going to bend it slightly so the corner matches the upright. And then throw it in. And then take the other three. Do the same thing. At your marks. Just make sure they're angled the same way on every one. Last one. What you're going to do is flip it over and screw in the other side. So you're using two, six per, two screws per board on this side, and then we're going to flip it over and do the other side. And we're going to make sure that nothing hangs over the edge of it. It's a pretty simple process once you get the hang of it. It usually takes no more than 10 minutes to put this together once you have everything cut. So this is going to be the last one on this side. Then we're going to flip it over. And we're going to find out why the marks on the other side are important. So we put this, put this over. Take this one, and now we're going to match the bottom. So now you see that the bottom on the first side is going to be over here, and I have both notches there, and I line up my measurement marks so that they're the same. And there we go. And we put these this side in. You can start at either end. It doesn't really matter. And because you have those marks, you can tell where your other one is and try to line them up the same way. hard to see with the video, but and we're going to flip it over, do the last four screws. And 
as you can see, it doesn't really shoot that well. And what you're going to do after we're done, I will show you the finished ladder. You can see it doesn't take us that much time to put this together. And there you go. Ladder's done. And now all you have to do is stain it whatever color you want. This one's going to be a clear stain. Uh, but you can do dark or you can paint it. So paint it white. I've done white, clear, and dark stain. And that's it. Thanks.